Hi, my name is Miley Takita. I am currently in the Office Administration Trade at Wamanala Job Corps. I chose to come to Job Corps to get the education and training that I need to better my future. A little bit of background about myself and where I'm from. I was born and raised in the Marshall Islands, but I am originally from Fiji and a small island called Kiribati, which is pronounced Kiribati. Although I may not be Marshallese by blood, I still have so much love and respect for the Marshallese people and the island itself. Here's a little more information about my culture. Fiji is located in the South Pacific Ocean, just north of New Zealand. And tourism is its number one economic activity. There's a traditional skirt that is worn by men and women in the island of Fiji, which is called Sulu. Fijians also tell their story by doing the meke, which is a combination of traditional dance and storytelling through song. It is also a way of showing their love for their island. <laughs> Marshall Islands is located in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, just north of the equator. Most of the traditional clothing that are worn are sewn by the women of the island. There's a traditional dance known as beep that is usually performed on big events like first birthdays and holidays, just like Christmas. Another one is called Javwa that was created by our ancestors and is only performed during events for our chiefs and their families. Now I would like to show you an example of beep. Here is a small clip of the Marshallese men performing the Jaboa. Bikini Atoll, which is located in the Marshall Islands, was used for nuclear testing and peacetime atomic explosions that were conducted for experimental purposes. The people of the Marshall Islands were affected by this and are still suffering from this till this day. Kilves is located in the West Central Pacific Ocean, just northeast of Australia. The dancing is just as traditional as the music. The movement mostly involved outstretched arms and jerking movements of the head, feet, and hips. Kiribati is one of the countries that is most impacted by climate change. Two of the islands have been completely flooded and no longer exist. The remaining islands still suffer from flooding and the whole island itself is at risk of being consumed by water. All three of these islands have a great impact on my life and have shaped me to become the person that I am today. Just like all the other Pacific islands, we have faced many challenges and are still facing them till this day, but they have never stopped us from thriving. We celebrate Pacific Island Heritage Month every day and I'm proud to share a little bit about my culture with all of you. I am just a small representation of many students from all over the Pacific Island. Thank you, Komol, Vinaka, Korapa. And let me know if you have any questions. <laughs>